Okay, let's walk through your syringe pump administration. First off, we have the picture here of the syringe pump method that you went home from the hospital with. This picture just shows us how to connect our syringe to the pump. This particular pump we use when we're giving medications in a syringe and they're gonna take anywhere from 15 minutes to an hour to infuse. So the first thing we wanna do is we wanna clean off our surface. Very good. Now we have all of our supplies gathered here to our side. The first thing I like to do is I like to take my pump, my syringe of medication, and let's put the syringe into the pump. Now, you're gonna hold the pump in your arm. We're going to put the barrel of the syringe into this clasp. There's arrows here showing you how to do it right on the pump itself. We've put the flange of the pump into this little divot and then the sides close in on it to hold it there. Now, we wanna take the lever up here. It says to squeeze it fully, do just as it says, and slide it down till it meets the top of the barrel. Let loose and it will hold the barrel there. Now, we can just take this, we can lay it out, and now we're gonna lay out our supplies in order of how we're gonna step through them. So first, we're gonna to want to um, go ahead and lay out an alcohol wipe and a normal saline because we'll flush before we connect to the pump. After the pump is done, we're going to go ahead and we're going to do another alcohol wipe here and another normal saline. And we're gonna take our last alcohol wipe and put it between our pump and our first normal saline. Now, let's go ahead and wash our hands. Okay, let's pull down your sleeve. Carefully unwind your line till you're holding your clave in your hand. Now let's take our first alcohol wipe, tear it right through the middle. Take your alcohol pad, lay it right over the end of your clave, wrap it, and twist and turn for about 30 seconds. As we complete that 30 seconds, we can take our normal saline syringe, hold it up nice and straight, take the cap off. We're gonna remove the air till we see a couple drops, then we know we're good. Now, we're gonna hold that syringe nice and close towards the top. We're going to push into our clave, turn that on, and now we can do our quick and jerky flush. We're gonna push that all in as quick as we can. Then we're going to turn that syringe off. Lay that aside. One more alcohol wipe before we connect to our syringe. Again, lay over the end and twist and turn for another 30 seconds. Good. Now, when I do this, I like to slide my pump towards the edge of the table so that I've got the end of the syringe off the table. Okay, let's unscrew the cap on your medication syringe. Set that aside. Now, take your clave. You wanna meet it to the end of the syringe. Push in, turn on. Good, now you're connected. Now, on the pump itself, as you look at your syringe here in the, in the pump, as you look, there's a little arrow on the top of your uh, lever. And that arrow shows that this syringe of medication is gonna take us 30 minutes. Wherever that arrow points will tell you how long that administration time is going to be. Then as you look towards the bottom of the pump, you have on and off buttons. There's an on, an off, and then an on with an alarm. The on with an alarm, when it's all in and it's to the end of the syringe, there's nothing more to push in, it will beep so that you know that it's in and you're completed. So we wanna go ahead and turn that on. 
now. Very slowly, and you won't need to hold, you can just let it go, and very slowly that lever is going to move down and push that medication in. And we know it's gonna take 30 minutes. Okay, now we've seen our alarm has beeped. So we're going to turn it off. We're at the end. Now we can go ahead, we can unscrew your line, your clave from the syringe. Now we need to, we can set this aside. Now we need to finish flushing our line so that you flush the medication all the way through. So we can take our last alcohol wipe, open that through the middle, lay that alcohol pad right over the end of your clave, wrap it around, and twist and turn for another 30 seconds. When the 30 seconds is done, we can grab our last normal saline flush. We want to remember to remove that air. Once we see a couple drops, we know we've got it. Hold nice and close, push in, turn on, and now we're going to do that quick and jerky flush. As quick as you can. Once that's completed, you can twist that syringe off, and now your administration is complete. So we can go ahead, we can wrap that very loosely around your arm. You don't want to get it tight. Now you can pull that sleeve up and over so that holds it nice and tight to your arm. And it won't dangle. And your administration is complete.